Alright, so I'm recording this short video to clarify the textbook and the My IT Lab that's a requirement for this class. Anytime I get more than a handful of students asking me, I know I need to clarify, okay? So I talked about this um, in what's called a week zero video, but it has changed a little bit. So clarification is always good. And I put some updated information in here, but I just want to make sure we're clear. Okay, so for this course, you're going to need a textbook and you're going to need some online, um, I, you could call it software, but basically access to simulation to teach you Microsoft Office. Okay, and there is two ways to get this material. material. Now, obviously, this is cheaper, getting it from Pearson. So but it's fine if you get it from the bookstore. But let me just explain what you're getting. When you purchase the My IT Lab, you're actually getting the ebook inside of the My IT Lab. Okay? So in this sense, you're really only having, it, it may feel like all you're having to do is purchase the My IT Lab stuff, and then you're getting included in that the, um, textbook, but the way it's priced, it actually does include both. So if you're trying to go out and source the textbook by itself, you're going to be sadly disappointed to realize that you could have paid 79 to get both the textbook in ebook format and access to Microsoft Access or Microsoft um, MS Office for my IT lab. Okay, so I just want to be clear about that. And I've updated this because last semester there was a misunderstanding on my part that you used to be able to, when you bought it at the bookstore, get a hard copy. But that's no longer the case. The, as far as I know, the only way that you can get a hard copy is to request it from the My IT Lab folks. And I've never had a student ask me about it, so I never had to go over it. Okay. Uh, the thing I will leave you with here before I just quickly move over is that you do have to have this by February 9th um, in order because if you don't get it by that date, you can no longer purchase it. And you can see based on our course that it is a required um, without it, you will not be able to pass this class. Okay, so before the start of the semester or even after, I've provided a link based on the section that you're on, and it's a link that gives you the detailed step-by-step -step instruction for how to set up your My IT Lab account. Okay, so I've already I'm already logged in over here. I just want to show you that once you get in, then you have the ebook is here for the tech the tech um, tech in action. And then the whole system is where the My IT Lab is located. You just happen to have access, meaning you have a link within the My IT Lab for the ebook. Okay, so hopefully that helps clear up any questions that you may have had. You have to get the My IT Lab, and by getting the My IT Lab, you get an ebook version of the textbook. Okay? All right, so uh, I'm going to add this to the week zero, and here's what I mean by that. Right now, I do have, and I still recommend you watch, um, a video that I've produced in the past uh, that goes over more detail of what this class entails, but I will add this video just so students can have the current, this semester, spring uh, 18 ver uh, version of the required textbook materials. Okay, thanks. Talk to you later.